I, I lost my first wife in 1985, and uh, married in 87, and moved to uh, South Anne Arundel County. Uh, we were there for about 18 years, and a uh, nice place uh, right on Chesapeake Bay, but it got too much gardening. My wife was an avid gardener, and I'm not. <laughs> so I finally said, uh, I don't want another season of doing everything in the garden. And uh, it was fortunate for us. Uh, at that time, we just said to some of the neighbors, when we're packing up, and people were knocking on the door to buy our house. And uh, so we left there in, in uh, 05 and moved to an apartment where we'd actually uh, lived for a year before we went down there to decide whether we were going to come to a retirement community or not. And if the apartment had worked out more satisfactorily, we probably would have stayed there. But uh, it wasn't, they weren't ma maintaining it properly. And we had already looked at uh, several retirement communities and we're on the waiting list. And then we heard uh, Peg had a relative here at uh, Collington. And uh, so we'd heard about Collington and we got a letter from Collington uh, asking us to come by, which we did, and uh, it was a, a cottage available at the time, so we grabbed it. Well, one of the reasons we came uh, here and it, because the cottage is right close to the tennis court, and uh, I loved tennis over the years and still I've been playing here. Treasurer of the woodshop since uh, almost uh, when I arrived and uh, my participation in the woodshop is primarily electrical fixing lamps and so forth. Uh, I'm really not a wood woodshop expert by any means. Uh, well we were uh, both well into our 80s when we came and uh, uh, fortunately, uh, at that time, we were both in good health, and uh, this is a retirement community, not a nursing home, and uh, we probably waited too long. Uh, I think people should come a little earlier in their uh, life.